Welcome to the channel, guys. We're back in the office. Well, it ain't an office yet, but it's gonna be. I uh, just got back from the hardware store. Uh, today, we're gonna get those tucked up in there. I've got these steel plates that will go where they're at so I don't nobody in the future runs a nail or whatever through it. Then I'm gonna build a box around this. So I've got the I just picked up a couple of one by fours. That's all we're gonna need. And that's actually gonna have the bead board around it. So it'll look like it'll it'll blend in with the rest of the walls. So that's gonna be a simple probably just run up to the ceiling. And then just frame around it. And I've got uh, a piece that goes on that as well. Uh, and then hopefully get to some walls. I don't know. We got to get all the prep work done. I don't want to get all the walls up and start on the ceiling and then find out, well, I missed something. Another thing I'm going to do is I am going to pull that wire that I ran for the dryer. And we'll put brand new wire, the, the right length for it. And then I'm going to wire a plug. And then I'm going to buy a new dryer. I know. I hate to. But that one's never worked right. And I ain't got time to screw with it. Because it's on its way out. It probably just... I'm going to look at it. I'm going to look at it. I think where I went wrong is when I went in that junction box. When I made that junction box. I did not ground it to that box. Who knows, but there could have been a nick in that old wire that I had. But I'm buying brand new wire. We're going to run it separate from the rest of that stuff. And I'm not going to do that today. I went and looked at the price of that stuff. Woo, man. But I'm going to buy it uh, here in a couple days and get that done. Then I can insulate the ceiling and get the ceiling on. But that, that's not going to come for a few days anyway because we're going to be focusing on getting these walls on. Uh, once the walls are on, I'll put the foam board in the ceiling. We'll put the metal on the ceiling. I'm going to trim that out like I did in the kitchen. Uh, I've got a lot of things I've been thinking about doing. Uh, let me show you. Let me pull you off and show you here. And uh, some may agree, but I'm tired of all the cedar. Let me get a light on here. This wall, I'm pulling all this cedar off all this, this wall here. So there's cedar I'll have. And uh, I'll tell you what's behind that cedar is this. This is behind that cedar. If you'll look, man, I'm like two inches out from the original wall. And I'm going to take a look at that, see how it looks. Uh, I may leave that. I may just take it down to the sheetrock and paint it. Because I want to get rid of some of this cedar. There's just too much in here. And I want to get some painted walls. Just kind of make it look a little better. I just don't like this. And then the ceiling. That was the first thing I ever did with cedar. And I did a horrible, horrible job with it. There are huge gaps. I did not run them through the saw or the uh, circular saw and square them off. So what I need to do is start at this end. Pull each board. Run them through the circular saw. Get a nice straight edge and gap them right. They shrunk a lot. I did not, I should have put them together when I first hung them. I did not, I didn't know anything about hanging cedar. So the, the ceiling's going to get redone. That's not right away. We're going to finish these projects first. So I'm going to get busy, man. It's about 1030. It's, it's, I'm getting a late start. And I don't know if this is going to work. I picked up this box. So once I get the wall board on, I guess this box hangs. And <laughs> I don't know. This plate, this plate goes over and you drill a hole. I'll make this work. That was a, the only other thing I could find is on Amazon. They got a tube that goes through the wall, but it's made. It, it doesn't have anything blocking the outside. So it's more or less made from room to room. Like if you were already inside, there's going to be a hole. And they wanted 15 bucks for that, so I'll I'll come up with something else. So, if we get to the wall board today, this is going to have to just be unplugged and just pull it all out as one single strand like I have it. Unplug it from there, and that's it. But uh, let's see where we get. Uh, I may just start on this wall or that wall. Who knows? All right, guys, I'm going to get busy. Ah. All right. 
I gotta be really careful up here. I don't wanna hit a live wire. Ah. And I don't wanna go too wide. Let me get these out of the way. You! Get out the way. First dad blame place. Same you right there. tool does very easy beats having a jigsaw up there risking all that you know so now the plan we'll get this as flat as I can get her up in there you going up in there I might have to go a little deeper not if I get this flat oh And no, this is not the proper way to wire stuff. You would just, you know, I've done this over years. <laughs> and this has been like the catch-all room. And, well, it's, we'll do, we'll fix it in there later, you know. Well, I'm paying the piper now. Okay, so now that's, that's out of the way. So I'm just going to pound one of those deals in there. I would like that to be up a little more. There we go. Okay. Okay, it's a short time later. Just just a short time later. I, ha I had to go find my hammer. <laughs> yeah. 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 Alright, let me get that tool out of there. Bam! We got this hair plate. Yes, sir. Pow, pow, pow. That 
triple A. No Yahoo's gonna put a screw through there. I want to thank a subscriber for reminding me of those things and I probably wouldn't even have thought of it until this point. And then I'm like, hey man, I, I need those plates. So we got them done. So see, I do read y'all's comments. And uh, I want to thank everybody for all the Christmas cards. Uh, Chia, I got your seeds today. I got a really cool headlamp. I never, I always wanted one of them. I don't have one. Didn't say who sent it. I got a $58 Walmart card. Again, nobody, nobody's name was mentioned. I used that on canned dog food. That helped me out a lot. But for everybody that sent cards and, and gifts, I thank you very much. I don't always open them on camera because I'm too busy, man. And a lot of people don't like that. So I quit doing that. But uh, I, I did get them and I appreciate it. All right, let's move on to this one. <sighs> this one I could almost disconnect. I'm not going to we'll cut a hole for that too. All right, I'm gonna film those. Come back when I'm all done. All right, main power is shut off. I'm gonna go ahead and wire this up because it's gonna be in the way. We'll get it wired. I'm right in the way, ain't I? There's just nowhere y'all know where to stand where you can see stuff, all right? Just get right there. I don't know where to put you. You guys need to learn where to go, because what, what, what am I supposed to do, for, hire a full-time cameraman? Probably could wear a head strap. Note to self, I dropped the screw. Look for it later. Right. The main breaker's off on the main panel. I'm also going to cut her off on this, this panel. What in the name? This is the hardest breaker to shut off I've ever seen. And just for giggles, we're going to test it. Dead, dead, dead. I heard something. There's no... How is that live? I don't trust it. I did this thing's no it ain't live all right so let's put it right there in that empty spot I actually had all my tools ready got everything ready but a knife I ain't got one hang on hang on I just had a knife my goodness. Bring y'all back when I got a knife. Alright. Reading glasses. My goodness. Alright. Let's go up right. I already got a spot right there. 14 2 is nice to work with. Especially after working with that. 10 to what does is it really necessary to put that much thick you know it's a, it's a ground wire get on out of there where's my stripper ah. right, i'm trying to stay out of the way guys my camera skills are terrible when i'm doing this kind of work. Got a brand new pair of strippers. <laughs> yeah, can't find them. Brand new. All right. Breaker, breaker. 10-4. All right, guys, it's in. Neutral, neutral bar, ground, ground wire, and the hot to the breaker. The breaker is off. And uh, somewhere, it's, it's up in New Jersey or New York or somewhere, there's a bar that watches YouTube, and they're watching my channel. 
And right about now, somebody's going, Hey Sal! I got 20 burns the joint down in a month. Yeah, I got you. Yep, you know there is, man. Uh, all right, I'm gonna put this cover back on. I'm gonna go out there and flip the breaker and then I'll bring you back when I test this outlet. Gonna take bets? I bet it's good. All right, guys, let's flip the bar breaker. Now, we should have juice to this outlet. There's the tester. Correct. Correct. And that ends that era. All right, guys, I don't think I ever explained to you why the service panel is there, right by the window like that. Originally, I put it there. Okay, somebody had given me the service wire and it was four feet short of making it to the other panel so the only solution other than to go out and this at this time i had very little income so the only other solution was to move it down here and that's why i did it there it was not my first choice to have it there but it saved me several hundred dollars uh because service wire is not cheap and because this is buried underground it actually goes through the the pvc pipe and goes down and it goes a couple feet underground back up into that previously i had it running straight across into the house and i hated that so now we got an open alley in there but that is why i thought i'd come back and explain that i did find that other screw by the way still missing a couple it, it never had these so i need to pick up a few more so now i'm going to start uh I'm, I'm looking at this trying to figure out how to build this box because this kind of I got the one by fours, which I was going to go straight up and box that in, which I still am. But this kind of throws me off right here. So I'm going to, I'm going to come up with something here. Uh, I'll probably come out with another two by four here. That way, when I run my bead board, it can just go straight and then back out that way. Now, let's see what I come up, up with. All right, I need to give this some more thought over here. So I'll tell you what we'll do. Let's just move on to hanging some wall board. Let's start. Let's try to get this wall complete right here and see where we get after that. Uh, maybe we'll do that one last, at which means I got to unhook all of them at the DVR, simply push them back and then uh, put the wall on, drill the hole, and then shove the whole lot of them through there and then put it back where I got it. That should, we might just do that right, right now first. I don't know maybe this one I hate this let's let me let me insulate this and then we'll get it done because that's ugly I want to I want to get that over with all right gonna go out and do some measurements all right guys you're supposed to cut this from the back but I'm just gonna use this tool it'll be all right uh, it is very windy very windy Close enough. We'll bring this tool in. We got to do any more? We can do it right on the spot. Hi there. I'm not on the ground. You guys are sitting in your chairs. I'm not comfortable. You are. Flicking her when I get her stood. 
Understood. Oh, like working in a sardine can for good nights. Hey, let's put it this way. That'd be cool, wouldn't it? Alright, now I gotta spin her around. Shimmy, 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 shimmy. Shimmy, shimmy. Alright, Sal and Guido, you betting on this? The little fit? Probably should have got the junk out of the way. Pretty. But we got to do some squaring, man. Oh, I'm sitting on a piece of junk. Why didn't you sweep the floor, Mike? Alright, I have to do a little trimming. That's gonna work out. It's actually gotta come up that much off the floor, so that's gonna take care of that. And yeah, we'll get her. All right, let me fight it. Ah! You ain't gonna stay, are you? All right. Well, and I don't have all the nails and stuff in like at that top. That'll pull over. Man, I'm kind of don't want to use a magic marker. Look at that black mark next to that, and then I broke the outlet cover. That could have came out a little further. <laughs> Uh, oh well let me tell you something this stuff is difficult if you are by yourself trying to raise it up and get this lined up it's not easy man yeah i fought it i fought it hard so now i'm just gonna get cut this stuff out right here i think i'm skinny enough now oh yeah yeah i'll just get the sawzall or something i'll probably just use that tool and cut that out all right, I'm running low on time, so let's just try to stick one here. See what? Maybe we can get one over there too. But I'm running out of time. I've got a few other things. I got to work on uh, Libby's kennel. I got a new gate latch. Uh, she has one on there, but at the bottom, it kind of she can push it out. And sometimes, found out what's what's scaring her at night. That dang white dog has been showing up and then i guess that's her trying to let me know but i caught him the other day and it just never ends guys so this will just be carry it in throw some glue on it and uh nail her up let me let me see my studs right here so i built this wall so i know i just need to make sure Let's see, I'm just gonna go flush at that corner, four foot. That'll give me enough room to build what I gotta build here. Yeah, because that gives me an idea of where I need to start building that, that box around the panel. All right, let me go grab one. It's hard to film anything in this little room, guys. I need to stay in little room. Why didn't I sweep up the crap <clears throat> before? All right. Well, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Right there. Man, who built this wall? Because I'm going to tell you, pretty darn square. It is. Kind of grass and everything else. And I got that. Why is that wire in the way? It'll be all right. All right. I'm not going to film the fight because it is a fight. Don't you move. Ha <laughs> ha. All right. I'm going to lean this back, glue it, stick it. All right, that wall board glued and stuck. And there's some nails in there too. Tops, bottoms, and the studs, just a few. 
So, we're getting there, man. Really ain't a whole lot left to go. There's a full sheet. And full sheet, maybe two full sheets. So, the next uh, step is get the rest of it on. I got to go work on Libby's uh, gate. Because, uh, don't want her getting out. All right, man. Well, made a little progress. I would have liked to got more done, but like I say, you know, I'm getting late starts on this stuff, and then I gotta stop. It, it just it ain't light very long. You guys know that. And uh, eh, it went all right. It's difficult putting this, these, some of these pieces up by yourself, but I handled it. We got it. We'll get it. Uh, there's a will. There's a way. So I can't wait to get all this crap covered up. And then ice trim, I'll tell you guys, you'll see, I'm gonna paint it, and you guys will see, that's the way it'll be. It's gonna look good. All right, man, I'll try to get one out to you tomorrow. Happy trails. It is windy. Isn't it windy? How come you're so much trouble? People look at you and go, oh, she's so cute. They don't know you. They don't know the troubles you give me. Get your ball. Get that ball. Alright, here's what I did to Libby's gate. Trouble was, let me show you. You, know, you shouldn't have to do this with eight-year-old dogs. But that's all I had before. Okay. And shit. So what would happen with that before that was there? This could be pushed in or out. It took a little bit of strength, but it could but it could happen. So now I got that. And then I'll put a little thing in there. This can't be pushed in or out. And I'm actually gonna bend this in a little more too. So that one there is a lot of work. I would probably pay somebody, I don't know, $15 to come get her. She does like to play with the ball. You wanna get that ball? Yeah, you put on that sweet act until the camera's off. <laughs> That's when you haul off and nip at me. Yeah, yeah. She gets she got grumpy at me last night. We went to get her for a she goes for two walks a day. Good ones. She didn't want to go last night. But I made her. Because I gotta get her off that cable. I don't want to put her in the kennel with that cable on. Get that ball. What are you gonna do with that big old chunk of ice? Get that ball. Get it. Get it. You old floppy eared goon. You old floppy eared goon. What you saying? Help! Help! There Help. was no giant octopuses in your yard. You always got some story. Help! Help! I don't believe you for a minute. Don't be teaching these girls to tell fibs, because it don't work. Probably wouldn't be bad if you said a cow was in the yard, but a giant octopus, you don't even know what they are. Uh.